Hey, yo, it's C. King Fight News, and Eddie Hearn had this to say to Al Heyman. He said, thank you. And, and let's get into why it's C. King Fight News. We got more on this. Hey, yo. Back at it. Y'all know what it is, man. And, and we in here, man. So Eddie Hearn uh, publicly thanked Al Heyman. Uh, in, in a recent interview with Fino Boxing, he said, you know what? I got to thank Al Heyman for not blocking uh, Andy Ruiz as an opponent. And it would be, he, he, he actually used something of um, so, uh, an analogy towards the Joshua Wilder fight. And he said, you know what? It's likely that Joshua will sign a DAZN deal. But he's going to try and keep him a free agent as long as he can in order to try and secure the Wilder fight for Undisputed. Uh, we'll see if that's true. Because honestly, if I'm DAZN, why sign Joshua? If he's not gonna bring in um, Canelo-like ratings, why, why even do it? You know, um, Canelo broke through in, in there with the Dane Jacobs fight uh, that did pretty, pretty damn good numbers for the zone, and they're looking to see something similar with Anthony Joshua. Will that happen? Considering the late replacement with Andy Ruiz, and how competitive is that fight really? Um, a lot of people think Andy Ruiz can pull off an upset, right? There's there's a few people that that believe in Andy Ruiz. Um, I think Andy Ruiz could give Joshua some fits, but I don't see him beating. Anthony Joshua by any means I don't see him being I think it would be interesting if he went 12 rounds that would definitely look quite poor on Joshua's regard I mean this is a guy that arguably beat Joseph Parker but the way Joshua fought Parker you know it, it left it, it left more to be desired like he kind of that wasn't a good fight at all. So I think he can redeem himself if he were to stop an Andy Ruiz here. Um, and I think he will. I personally believe Joshua will stop Andy Ruiz at some point. Um, it could be a TKO stoppage. The ref might jump in. But I, it ain't going to be no first round KO. I'll tell you that much. It's going to be accumulation of punishment. It's going to be um, him maybe hurting Andy Ruiz with um, uh, a straight right hand. You know, I think it will be the right hand that does the job. And I think he's been lucky. He's been very lucky to find guy like Andrew Ruiz to fight you know he, he is orthodox you know he's not a Cuban southpaw that is is pretty renowned right is pretty fucking dangerous it's not Luis Ortiz and he should be happy he ain't fighting Luis Ortiz he should be very happy because that, that was a whole different style matchup that he never, he never had to deal with um, but end of the day I actually believe Andy Ruiz is a tougher fight compared to Dominic Brazil as an opponent. So we'll see how AJ deals with Andy Ruiz on short notice. Um, it could be a gift and it could be a curse. So we'll see how it plays out, man. He can't fight news. Smash the like button and subscribe to the channel and hit that bell icon. Y'all know what it is, man. E-Kings fighting you. 
and we're out, man. We're out for now, man. What do y'all think, man? What do y'all think about uh, Wilder? Wilder! Wilder! But that KO was magnificent, man. I gotta say. That was, that was something beautiful. That knockout. Didn't have to stay up too late. <laughs> you know? So it is what it is, man. He can't fight news. And we're out, man. Peace.